Hey everybody, might be wondering why I'm showing you this tenth of an ounce small gold coin. It has a little rabbit on the back. Well, I bought 100 gold bats, and one gold back is worth one thousandth of an ounce. And so, all this right here is one tenth of an ounce of gold. While I talk about why I bought them, I'm going to show a close up of each gold back that I bought. Also, I'm not a financial advisor at all, so make your own choices if you want to buy these. Or even gold for silver for that matter. When it comes to savings, I stack silver and gold. And the main reason why I stack silver or gold when it comes to emergency savings is because it does a lot better to keep up with inflation than a savings account. And if any of y'all are stackers out there, y'all probably scratching your heads because if you know anything about gold bats, the premiums are really high. Kind of a little bit more than gold coins and stuff. So you're probably wondering, why on earth will I buy this to add to my savings? Well, it really comes down to my fear of the central bank digital currency. Now this month, not this month, but next month, they're coming out with the Fed now. And when you look at it, Fed now is really is a good thing. We really need to upgrade our system. However, they really want their own digital currency. They're really pushing for it. And I really believe FedNow is setting us up to where they can easily intimate that later. So, I really just want another currency that I can use just in case my fears are true. That doesn't involve cryptocurrency or digital currencies and that's where these gold bats come in in fact right now there's four states that have gold bats that have their own currencies in the current states that are using the gold bat system it's new hampshire wyoming nevada and utah in fact south dakota is coming out later this year you might be wondering if you have a know anything about gold bats or anything like that is is this legal for states to have their own money and surprisingly when you look it up the answer is yes it's in the constitution but they have to use silver or gold only and that's where the gold bats fill in that gap for them and people are actually using these in those states Plus, as you're looking at these, I mean, the artwork on them. Each of these bills are gorgeous. I mean, they're beautiful. I was highly impressed with how they look and feel and how durable they seem to be. And how they operate, it's really simple. One gold back is one thousandth of an ounce. And as you see right here, this is five gold bats right here. That is one two, one two hundred of an ounce. So if you take five one gold bat bills, those five one gold bat bills is the same weight in gold as this five gold bag. And the same thing goes for the ten. They also have a twenty-five. And then a 50 gold back spill. And I do have to do a quick shout out to Wyoming here. This is my favorite. This five gold back bill from Wyoming is the best artwork I've seen. It is so beautiful. Very impressive. And you might be asking, how much can I barter one gold back bill for? Well, it fluctuates with the price of gold, just like coinage and all that stuff and everything. And right now, one gold back is worth $4. And you can find that information out on the gold back website at goldback.com. 
So one gold back is four bucks, and five is twenty, and ten would be forty, and of course that means twenty-five would be one hundred, and fifty is two hundred dollars. And I have to say, be careful where you buy them. I normally buy my gold coins and all that stuff from J.M. Bulletin, and they overpriced their gold backs. I think it's like five or six bucks for one gold back or whatnot. But if you go to gold back, goldbacks.com and everything, um, they have a list on their website of authorized dealers. And you can click on each one and find the best price. And if you do it that way, I mean, like I got these less than four dollars, you know, per gold back. So you gotta make sure you do your shopping around if you're interested in it. So since these are meant for circulations to be spent and all that stuff and everything, and also since the premium high, these are not going to be a bid percentage at all for my stat that I have for emergency. But I really like the idea of a bill that's not only backed by gold that you can borrow with, that is actually gold itself. I think it's really cool, amazing, and I hope this been kicking off. They start in 2019 and everything, and I mean, since then, more states been going on, more people been using them and stuff like that, and it has great potential. It might end up being a flop or not, but who knows? I mean, maybe it will really kick off, especially with people fear like me. So take care and have a great day. Okay.